Hello, Scorpio. Welcome to Sidekick Tarot. I'm Ryan. Thank you for being here. This is going to be a general reading for you may be dealing with and what they're up to. And for more tarot readings after this, go ahead and check out my wife's channel at Val 53 Tarot. She's read for you as well. Thank you. Hmm. I'll be starting by pulling their current or overall energy. And then we'll be going into clarifiers. I don't know why I just got the image of someone's eyes being glossed over. Like trying to hold back the tears. Okay, I'll get the cards out first and then I'll begin. Very different. Different messages. Interesting. Um, who's, I'll just say it, who's playing with the planchette? Mm, better know what you're doing. It's not going to resonate for everyone, of course. Possibly within the dark of night. There's a tower. Like I said, you better know what you're doing. One more. Yeah, yeah, careful. Careful with that. Hmm. Wow. Kind of a smart-ass energy, but we'll go with it. Jumping into this, Scorpio, right away what they're showing me. Things are definitely moving forward for them very, very quickly here. And I feel like something here is being straightened out and made right. At the same time with whatever new financial project that they're on the process of making and putting together for themselves. I don't exactly know what this is because there are some sort of problems and issues here. Let me show you. I kind of do like this card, though. Um, looks like a little skeleton Grim Reaper man. Um, kind of like a dark wraith or something. But whatever these issues are, I do see that they are trying to acknowledge them and figure out what they can do because of them. And so they're filling things out. And ultimately, there is something here that they are truly letting go of. So I kind of feel like it's like, scratch that. Something's not working. Because they're ultimately showing me that finances are a little bit difficult and tight right now. To the point where they're a little bit emotionally unsure as to what changes they want to make. But they are making changes. Now, whatever these changes are, I do see it is causing quite a bit of stress, anxiety, fear, and worry as to how things are going to result. And that is where that, well destruction happens unfortunately not to worry or be scared or anything like that it's just something here is clearly not working but ultimately after everything is said and done they're showing me don't worry about it i got it all handled okay let's go ahead and jump into clarifiers and see what else we can find someone dropped the ball let's see They're tiptoeing. With things ramping up the way they are, they are definitely tiptoeing. It is to the point where kind of like it's it's not even tiptoeing. It's sort of like saying they're having to watch their step. It's like, what's going to happen? Are they going to fall through the floor? There's like this overall energy of uh, the tail tucked between the legs. Phew. Yeah, you win some, you lose some. They understand that. That's clear. You win some, you lose some. But immediately with that, it's like game over. They're done. They don't want to play no more. They're, they're saying, yes, I'm fully 100% on board with trying something new or different for myself. Um... They have some type of project in mind to start some sort of passionate new beginning. It doesn't have to be a passionate beginning with someone. It could be with themselves and their finances or their investments, but you never know. We'll see. No, it's about someone. It's about someone that they're wanting to approach. They're 
filling it out. They're not too sure though. They're kind of, um, it almost feels like they're circling someone. I'm not gonna say they're a shark or anything. It's just kind of like um, running around, trotting around, thinking about them. Well, there's a tiptoe energy. Everyone knows this one as the thief. The um, So even though they know they have to, <laughs> geez, even though they know they have to surrender and let something go, they're clearly trying to figure out what to do because of all this. It's like, well, uh, maybe you just need to take a break. Maybe you need to kind of like back away from this. <laughs> geez, 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 geez. They're not even too sure what to do at this point. They're, they're really trying to remain grounded, but it's beginning to affect the living situation. And they are getting a little bit foolish. I'm looking at 444. They seem to like me. At the same time, they're kind of like, hmm. Damn it, Morty. Interesting. Seek out someone who knows. But are you loyal? Hmm. They're not too sure what they want. I feel like they want to open up their options and their possibilities, but this is more so in the energy of, well, emotional options, emotional possibilities, because they're looking for some type of fulfillment personally for them. I'm not too sure who that was. They're stressing out about some type of financial opportunity, but overall with whatever this opportunity is for them, they're saying, could this possibly be new love or could it not be new love? Again, I'm not too sure if this is with someone or with themselves. They're stressing about it though. Highly stressing about it. They're thinking about being single. They are. I kind of feel like even though there is this energy of like, um, geez, 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 geez. Whew. Yeah, that's that. That is that. Unless this is something else that I'm sensing, but... Whatever this shocking thing is, they're looking over their finances over and over and over and over again. They're trying to be smart. <laughs> Hello, magician. Hello, magician. Ain't that something? Like I said, be careful how you play with that energy. But, <laughs> geez, there is some type of collaborative energy here. I don't know if it is between the two of you or if it's with someone else in consideration about this. Um, but ultimately, they are trying to, let's just say, change their luck. So, of course, if you are dealing with anyone here, we do have showing up. By the way, with Pisces on top of the deck, watching and listening to everything, we have Libra. Gemini, Virgo. Cancer. And that is all. Goodbye.